Expectations were sky high as passengers crowded the Southwest Airlines gate, waiting for an unobstructed view of what for many will be a once in a lifetime experience. It's a reason to have a party and love making an event or something. Many passengers on flight 1721 booked their seats months ago. They wanted to celebrate the celestial event Southwest style. Can anyone tell me the first person? In addition to swag bags, trivia games and solar themed cocktails, the real treat for these passengers was getting a unique view of an extraordinary event. What are you expecting? Um, this, <laughs> if we can see this, it would be great. Takeoff of Flight 1721 was a chance to chase totality across the sky. From Austin to Indianapolis, passengers could experience it longer than people watching from the ground. Many passengers were enthralled by the color-filled horizon and darkening of the sky, comparing it to a stunning sunset. But where some struggled was finding a comfortable spot to see the moon block the face of the sun. The sun itself, I would say, was pretty underwhelming. The sun was positioned almost directly above the plane, so passengers quickly realized the only vantage point was on the floor looking straight up through the window. We had to lay down on the floor to see a tiny little glimpse of it, like a little tiny little thing. It will be 21 years before the next total solar eclipse in the U.S. It will stretch from California to Florida in 2045. And this is the advice from some passengers. For anyone planning for the next one, I think you better see it from the ground if you can. But it's still really fun and I think you interesting experience. Passengers told me there were two things they really liked about being on the flight. One, they were 35,000 feet up and could look out over the horizon. The other was not having to worry about the weather. There could be dark clouds, rain, really anything, and they were above it all. Reporting in Indianapolis, Betty Cross, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.